I want to show you how I am going to take the signature from this little block and I'm going to put put it so that I can follow it with free motion on my uh, sewing machine. So I have this product, it's called Heat Away by Floriani. It um, actually irons off, which is really cool. And um, I have this neat uh, surface here. It's <clears throat> It's got a, a magnet um, on the on the cutting mat, and I'm going to just make sure that these stay nice and straight. And then I'm going to just follow. And I know my shadow is probably in here, but I'm just going to follow this the lines that these people have put on here. And um, I will tell you that the bubbly side is going down against the paper and against the fabric. This is actually um, a product that they use to keep the um, little nubbies of a towel from poking through. And um, But I found it's a great transfer tool because this Sharpie will just disappear. Whoops, I've didn't follow that quite where it was, but it'll be okay. It'll be close enough. And then, you know what I think I'm going to do, because this name is so close to this star, I'm going to actually move this over just a little bit, and then I'm going to follow it. And then Billy, I, I hate to, I hate to not have this stable because then it won't work. Okay, so here's Billy, and um, this will actually iron away when I get finished. So now here it is. It's on this sheet right here. Ooh, my C almost didn't come through. I see my my Sharpie didn't pick up all of the C, so I'm going to go back in. It's real easy to just lay it back over it. <clears throat> and this is all going to iron off when I get finished. Now, where this is going is is a cool little thing that I actually went ahead and I did the hearts <clears throat> and the because I didn't I wanted those to be embroidered on my sewing machine and so I planned off it's kind of hard to see I know because of the glare um, I planned off this stuff so that it would come exactly where they wanted it and that's the way it's gonna look so once I get this all taped down now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this piece I usually try to cut it so that it's not not follow you know falling over the edge. So I have I have some of this. Um, it's kind of like painter's tape. You could certainly use painter's tape. This is for embroidery. Again, it's a Floriani product. And so now I've got this a little closer to where I want to put it. Now, in order to stabilize this. When I go to sew it, and I've got to clip threads yet, you can see, I'm going to tape this right down to the fabric. And then when I get over to the sewing machine, you'll see that way, and I kind of pull this a little tight so that it has no play in it because we don't want to have a it buckle on us and then we don't know where we're going. So... Um, so I want to make sure that I have it nice and tight so I kind of pull pull it away from the, the center out and then I tape it. Now the next thing I do is set up my sewing machine for free motion embroidery and I'll, I'll show you kind of how I'm going to do that in the next video. I'm going to show you now how I follow the lines that I have already drawn out on this uh, heat away uh, 
transfer paper. Um, I followed someone's writing and now I'm going to follow it with my sewing machine. And what I'm doing is I've got my feed dogs dropped and I've got about a 1.0 width and I'm going to just go over to the Y now. I'm going to follow it because if my feed dogs are dropped my hands are actually the things that are moving and I'm over here on the side I've taped this down and I have stabilizer underneath which makes a huge difference you have to stabilize otherwise it's going to buckle pucker or whatever you want to call it so now I'm going to use my um, cutting automatic cutting uh, button here so that I don't have to drag that thread and now the next one I'm going to do is going to change a little bit. I'm going to change my thread and then I'm going to follow the next one and this is a little cursive so it's a little different but if you follow these just exactly the way they drew them it's just like writing and um, tracing. It's very very easy.